Hi guys, this is me Sonia and I'm back with another scrapbook process video for you. I am playing along with Christy's Beautiful Life, her 30 day sketches in series 6 and they are in day 11. This is the sketch. I finally got caught up. I will do a flip through of all the ones that I did because I was um, in the hospital and I couldn't really start the series but I really wanted to do it so when, as soon as I got home and got a little bit of strength I've been working on it so I will show you that in the next video but for now we're gonna work on this one which is for today and it'll be uploaded today um, I got everything cut up cut cut out so um, I'm going to do it as real time and that way I can walk you through it. Hopefully it won't be that long. Okay, so I'm going to start with everything is matted. I matted everything, the photos. I matted, um, I cut out these stars of the glitter paper that I had in my stash. I had these letters in my stash. I think they're from Christmas from my hip kit club. Now this paper right here is from <clears throat> this collection of Heidi Swap. And I believe the collection is called, let me see. When and now, I think. Anyways, I'm not sure, but I, I'll link it down below. I got it at scrapbook.com, and I only got pieces of it here and there. So um, I'm gonna be using some of that. So following this sketch, I'm gonna work on this um, part of my cluster, the big part right here. And I'm just going to be starting to glue everything because that's all that's left to do. Um, these are pictures of uh, my little guy. We, in the summer, like to go jet skiing. So, um, these are pictures of him. And he loved his glasses. And he loved his uncle, his uncles in the army. So he loves to get dressed up like him. Now this, um, he's 12 now, so he's outgrown all of that. But I found these recently and I saw this background paper and I said, I have to scrap them. Those are the ones. So we'll work on that first. And I am gonna really, I have been really, really following the sketches as much as I can. Just because I, I thought it would be easier to just ca catch up with everybody. So what I did here, these are circle punched. Since I didn't have a big scallop one, I did the circle ones. And I just left off the edge. And I will use it as the big scallops. That's that part. This is from Hip Kit Club, from our, from um, our, I want to say September kit. No, no, not September. August kit. And I mentioned these are from way back there. And this string came with the collection. Old school, that's what it's called. I knew it would come to me. The collection is called Old School. Okay. So the first thing I want to do is put this on my frame. And I went with dark colors 
um, do because it was sunny outside and I thought it would be a good um, contrast for it. Um, the reason why I was in the hospital. I, I caught the walk-in pneumonia, they call it. Apparently it's silent. You don't know if you have it or not. I felt okay. I did have some coughing, some chest pain, but nothing major. But I did stay there for a long time until the, my lungs um, cleared out. Probably for a week or more. I think more. I forgot all about that. And I put glue on this. You see what I did? Mm. Guess I am going to use the washer today. wasn't part of it, but that's a thing. I don't even remember ordering the wash. So I'll have to cover up the seal and the tape. Um, back to what I was saying, um, I've been going through a lot of health problems. I, um, if you've been with me for a while, you know I have the chronic pancreatitis, which I go every four months to get, um, a stent replaced, and they unplug something down there <laughs> for, for me to um, order to, you know, survive. And then, um, on top of that, I recently got diagnosed with breast cancer. So, uh, the day before yesterday, they put a port on my neck. So, I've been trying to do the layouts without videos because it's much easier until I got caught up, which I just did today. And I'm proud, even though I'm so sore and it still hurts. I will be starting my chemo soon, in the next week or so, so I don't know how many layouts I'll be putting out there, but I'll be around. I'm definitely going to st stay close with my um, Off the Board, which is the last Wednesday, Wednesdays of the month. I am going to try to jump in with um, some Hit Kit exclusives, but I'm not affiliated with them. I just buy their kits. Um, I am in the Hello Kitty Kit with Style. Those, that one I want to try to keep up at least twice a week. And there and there, uh, this, this channel is also for my Bible journaling channel, so I'm going to keep try to keep up with those two very closely. Okay, so enough about me. Let's just keep playing here with these um, items. Let's see what I gotta glue next. I can't read the who the sketch is from. I 
believe the last name is Q-U-A-L-M-A-N, and it was from 2010. So. Okay. Now, the hardest part, I think, is going to be to put this scallop here where I want it and straight. So I'm just going to try to tape it with the washi in the back and then flip it. Do the how to kill a kit with style introduction do because I'm gonna be using the same one that I had the month before. I didn't get much layouts as I thought I would. So um that's what I'm gonna be doing. And I added the September how to kill September um hip kit club to it. So that's one of them. I want to get through that kit. Okay, I think I'm missing this one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of them. One, two, three, four, five, six. There's seven of them. I can't even count this morning. I think mine's are a little bit bigger. That's probably why, because I don't want to cover the whole page. Yeah, so I'll, I'll end up with those. That's it. I'll have two left over. So I'm going to put some adhesive. Hopefully they won't move. Sorry you can't hear my voice, it's kind of scratchy after the, the procedure. Oh, what did I do? I put the wash, well, that's okay, because it's going to get covered anyways. Alright, I'll put this thing straight. I'll attempt to put this thing straight. Two, I forgot, totally forgot, totally forgot. I was actually going to do these lines. And I would not make you watch this. So I will finish this up and then I'll be right back. strip on. Now this star goes here. And I am going to put it on foam. Something like that. It's that side. And then we can. You know that black little paper? It was given to me by my niece, and it has a lot of glitter. 
actually coming off. I think they made those anymore. Oh, I love me some glitter. Okay, so, um, those are these two right here. And then this, I don't want it, so I'm going to put this one behind, like that. So I'm going to scooch it in a little bit more, like that. Yeah, so. just want a little bit of journal in there. What I did notice was that I put the branding strip before the photos. Let's see if I can magically pull them up without making any kind of noise. Any kind of ripping. So far so good. Place these. Yeah, it's gonna have to go a little. I wonder if I should pour it up. No, I'm just gonna lay it flat. But I have scrapped one for his baby book already.
Okay, guys, this is the end of the video. I'm just jumping back in to just see the the outcome of it. Um, please check out um, the other ladies that are participating on these 30 days. I cannot guarantee that I would, but I will do catch up as much as I can. I really enjoy being doing these um, layouts. They something I've never done before so I really think I can do this I can do sketches I was scared of them somehow I don't know I wasn't being true to myself but like other youtubers say you put your own twist to it so and that's that's what I did so um subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed yet I would love to have you. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the notification box. And um, hit the bell button for you can get notified of all my videos when they come up. And I will see you soon. Thank you. God bless. Bye.